Hello world. We're going on a road trip. It is 5.05 a.m. Um, what's our first road trip stop, Justin? We're going to a, well, the petrified forest, but first we're going to the campsite that's 20 minutes away from the petrified forest. Wrong. The first stop is to get gas. Okay. Because we are just... on empty. All right. <laughs> really? Pretty close. Okay. Okay, and ice. All right. Made it to Fountain Hills, Arizona. But the fountain's not on. But the fountain's not on, but it is totally gorgeous. I mean, it's just before sunrise and they have bathrooms, so I'm not mad at all. <laughs> if I were touching it, of course, it'd be dangerous. Oh my god, it is so pretty over that way. Yeah, she is. Thank you. Really? There's a lot of dirt right now. A giant heap of money. We are listening to Harry Potter and the Methods of Rationality, which is a Harry Potter fanfic where uh, basically Harry Potter is very smart now, unlike the books, and approaches the wizarding world with uh, super... Like the scientific method. Basically, yeah, the scientific method. And also, he was raised right. <laughs> also, he was raised right. National Forest Overlook and over there is just a whole valley covered in trees but over here is just snow <laughs> road trip 2019 <laughs> it is <laughs> totally Holy gorgeous shit. out here <laughs> <We got> <laughs> neither of us knew there was gonna be snow so we are not prepared and both our shoes are full of ice we keep falling. We do, we keep falling. But it is so much fun. <laughs> Spring break 2019! <sighs> do it, please. Don't make this a champ. <laughs> Spring break 2019! miles it advertised no, way more than 13 miles it no it advertised 13 miles scenic okay. route well we've been here for like half an hour minutes, okay yeah and it's still dirt road it's been far more than 13 miles there's no service there's no service we're adventuring and it's very much dirt road like it's, no pavement whatsoever potholes on every corner it's great and they keep saying there's like exits and all these places to see there's no that's a lie <laughs> So it might be a little loud, but we're at this gorgeous lake. We've been in this gosh darn freaking forest for three hours because that random road, Justin, you're on camera. Yep. That random road that was supposed to be 13 miles was 45 minutes, and then we had to turn around and go another 45 minutes to end up the same place we got on. So it's been an hour and a half. We're still where we were. This is a and poorly designed <laughs> forest with no exit. This forest is hard. It's you really got to commit if you're gonna see the see the views. So. So now we're where we were two hours ago, and we're gonna try to make our way. Hi guys. Hi we're in the middle of a like 60 mile stretch of highway purgatory. in the desert. It's, it's very flat. Mm, purgatory. Mm. And we're freaking stopped. How, it's only one lane either way. Why is traffic stopped? It's 11.18 in the morning. How'd this happen? I nope. am happy because we made it out of hell forest. <laughs> Hell Forest was bad. We were in Hell Forest for three hours. Poorly designed forest with no exits. There is just... Also, we hit up a gas station. We did hit up a gas station. Which was nice, because we were getting, like, to the, the one-third mark. Mm -hmm. Which makes me worried about the environment. Me too. I have an update. We got to the campsite. Friggin' not allowed in. So now we're at a rock shop. They're 
not open yet. So we're out of rock. Trading post. Uh, it's 4:30 p.m. and we want dinner, but we also decided to drive to uh, the corner on Winslow, Arizona. It's just a. It's been a minute. Then you know where we are. Standing on a corner, in Winslow, Arizona. I've never actually heard that song. <laughs> figure out how to make us a little bit of breakfast and um, we're doing great. Petrified Forest National Park! Yay! Justin. Good. Good? It's very pretty. It is gorgeous. It's kind of less colorful than I thought it would be. But we're going to end up in the painted desert and I'm hoping that's a little more vibrant. It's so pretty. This bridge is made entirely of a fallen petrified tree. It's really cold out here. This is so poorly designed. <laughs> um, everyone's just sort of driving in random directions. The okay. Can you still come back in? Yeah. All right. Wow. Okay. Some restrooms. Some restrooms. Okay. But I have to tell you something. <laughs> Wait, hold on. This before, doesn't look very bef open. before you do, my favorite part is that it says Fred's Diner, but the letters are like, you know, look at that, and then look at that, and then it's even worse over here. <laughs> closed farewell bed, babe. Fe bedrock is closed forever. Oh. Closed. Thanks, Cartoon Network. You really did it this time. Show me 
your rocks. This is, uh, I'm thinking about getting these two. And I really want a quartz point like this, but I just don't have enough money. <laughs> What's your impressions? I can't even, like, words fail. It's so beautiful. This is totally insane. <laughs> We're at the Mather Out Overlook, right? Yeah. It's our first view of the Grand Canyon. Raven, do I know? No, just say nevermore. That's, that's all the Raven the actually night, says. Oh, that's true. Nevermore. No, you have to do it in the Raven voice and make the mouth. Duh. I, you try, oh. Never. Never. Oh my god. I won't. Don't yell at them. They look like camels. They're Australian kangaroos. I mean, American kangaroos. Good morning, Grand Canyon. <laughs> we packed up our tent and we are waiting to check out. It's in 10 minutes, so we're gonna go grab a hot chocolate at the, what's it called? What's that restaurant called? Uh, it's the restaurant by the general store. It's got, they have coffee. They have coffee um, and hot chocolate. Coffee and hot chocolate, and that's what we care about. So we're gonna go get a hot chocolate and then we're gonna go take some last looks at all these overlooks and then head to Utah. We're eating turkey cheese roll-ups in the car right now. That's our breakfast. <laughs> we'll see you later. Okay, it's the next day and these freaking elk are in the middle of the visitor center. Just hanging the heck out. We're literally just on the side of the highway. And this is a freaking view. Do you see where we are? We are in the watchtower. It's the Desert View Watchtower. Desert watch View Watchtower. Really so we're going through a giant oh. expanse of nothing. I mean, freaking red rocks. It's beautiful. I mean, it's gorgeous. Like, there's a lot of red rocks everywhere, but, you know, a rock is a rock. 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 Okay, we have gone from towering red monuments to giants to a uh, whole fucking lot of nothing. Empty purgatory. Update we made it to snow <laughs> and out of purgatory. I'm in a much better mood now. We're out of the flat desert oh. dead. Also, she got some food. You guys, you'll never guess where we are. For one, we've been driving for what, like three hours? More than that. Um, and we are still in the Grand Canyon Park. We're at the North Rim now. We were camping in the very tip, like the very beginning of the South Rim. And we have found a rest stop. Mm -hmm. We are so excited. I'm mostly excited. I was getting hangry. Yes. Welcome to the North Rim, I guess, or whatever. That road really looks like it's about to drop downhill really quickly. Um, yeah. Everybody's about to 7,000 elevation, we went back down 1,000. Yeah. Uh, video doesn't do it justice, guys. Are you take, leave it filming and I'll choose the best bits. Thoughts, Justin? What do you mean? I'm, I'm thinking that, like, this video doesn't even begin to... I 
feel like I can't even begin to take it in in real life <laughs> unless I stood here for like a full day. Yeah. Oh. It's gorgeous. Take our word for it. Look at that edge. That's all. That's all. Also, Grand Canyon. How freaking big is this thing? Very. Pretty grand. To Utah. Utah. Do you want to tell them the fun, exciting news about tonight? Uh oh. We there is a basically guaranteed chance of snow. So, hopefully we don't get snowed in, but it will be magical regardless. Yay, Utah! It is absolutely gorgeous here. And over there is our vintage trailer. Let's go. We made it. Welcome to the RV. Would you like to hear the tour? Uh, we have... You have to knock on the door like you're MTV. Are you? Okay, all right. Hi, MTV, and welcome to my crib. Come on in. To the left, we have the seating area, complete with deluxe storage options. What is that? And a broken thermometer. In the center, we have our deluxe, beautiful heating compartment and even a mini fridge with some little, what do we call it, prayer flags, nice little bouquet on the windows, as you can see here. And then you'll see the wonderful, luxurious, memory foam queen size mattress. <laughs> I'm vlogging. We woke up to a total winter wonderland and our shoes are somewhere under that. How many inches? Probably four, three or four inches of snow. Our shoes are under there. Rookie mistake. But look, just look. That is amazing. So, this is Portia, my car, and I love her like my child. And it's her first time seeing snow, and we don't know if she'll start, but we're just saying she will. And um, we decided to make some hot breakfast. So I'm gonna clear the snow off the picnic table and make us some scrambled eggs because that'll make us feel, I think, a little bit warmer. Oh my God, it is really freaking cold. Do you wanna update the vlog? Uh, the car started! We made it out of the camp. It is actively snowing, our words. Actively snowing, it's, there is snow falling down right now. Not the world, I mean, it might be normal to someone. We also can't really see past like the little stretch in front of us, which is kind of creepy. This is this how much we can see. Look, look out my window, there's literally, oh my god. There's very low visibility out here, boys. Silent hell. What are we like, two, three hours away from home? Two and a half. Ish. Two and a half, getting gas out of the snow for once. Uh. That's about it. That's about <laughs> Nothing it. Nothing much happens. We're gonna get some ice seeds. 